Yo, what is up guys, welcome back to another YouTube video. So today I will be teaching you how to make your own Gorilla Tag knockoff game. So first you want to have Unity downloaded and the 3.4.1 version. Then when that's installed you want to go to installs, install editor and install the 2021 version. And make sure you have Android ticked. And then when that's all done you want to go to projects new project uh, 3d core then you just want to name it whatever you want I'll just name it tutorial 123 and then create so guys when you're in your scene you want to go to edit project settings you want to scroll down to XR plugin management and install it so guys when that when XR plugin management is um, installed you want to you want to click open XR so guys when that is installed you want to scroll down click on open XR and then render mode change it to single pass to multi pass and then click the plus and then click valve index and oculus touch then come to the Android basically just do the same thing but there is um, no valve so just do oculus touch and then when that's done want to click XR plugin management go to Android and click oculus so guys when that's done you want to click oculus and then go to the little monitor and then just do the same thing but without adding any controllers so basically single pass to multi pass and, and then multi view to multi pass and then turn on lower overhead mode and then after that you want to back out of that and then you go to window package manager click the plus and then get URL and copy what is in the description if this comes up guys just click I made a backup go ahead and then when that's done I'm gonna press the arrow next to samples and then import starter assets and then when that's done you wanna click back and then if it didn't bring you in here so just go to your assets samples XR interaction toolkit and then 2.2.0 and then starter assets and then with these boxes just click on it and then add where it says like add just do that so add add that one add this one add and then add okay oh I didn't mean to do that so this one add this one add this one add and then guys when you've done that you want to click assets then go to edit project settings preset manager then where it says like right controller just type right no capitals no spaces and then for the left controller do left oh I spelled that wrong and then you want to click back and then should be done and then like to get like textures and all I'm gonna go window package manager and then where it says packages in project I'm gonna change it to unity and then search pro and then click pro builder and then click install and then when that's installed you want to click the X and then you want to go to tools pro builder pro builder window and then just put it somewhere by here and then we could just start building so just right click go down to pro builder and click cube and then when you hit and then on this on the right click and then use WASD and shift and scroll we and scroll um, shift just makes you go full speed and just WASD makes you move and then scroll mouse changes your speed so now with this pro builder you want to click the face selection tool and then just click any spot so we'll just do that side and then just drag it out then when you just drag it out it just gets a bit like a lot bigger just like a normal floor so I'm gonna build a map quick so guys I've just built myself a map and yeah just built this map let's drag these down a bit because you know 
kitchen the floor. There. Okay, now to get textures, let's create a new folder called textures and then open that folder and then go into like Google or something to get like grass textures. I already have textures here. So this is my metal texture, my wood texture. Oh, that don't work. Uh, my grass texture, stone texture. My other wood texture, which actually don't work, so we're just gonna delete it. Get the same one, a uh, brick wall. That grass don't work, let's drag that there. That one. Drag that one. That one. That's all like my textures I have. So we can just minimize it. So we'll do the grass grass and um, do this make that a uh, stone make the planks wood so there we go everything has texture but this has like texture you just gotta get really close up now for the gorilla tag locomotion I'll put the github link down in the description and when you download that you want to click assets right click import package custom package and then just go just go to where you downloaded the gorilla tag locomotion and double click on it and then this should come up make sure everything is ticked and then click import and action if this comes up just click it just click ignore because if you click reload it will delete everything and then when this is done like when everything is down uploaded you want to click on main camera at the top and just delete it and then open resources gorilla prefabs and then drag the gorilla rig just there just drag it here for now and then we can just move it down to about there we can rotate it if we want to just facing that way and then we could change the color of the hands by making a new folder called colors just double click into it then create material then click the white rectangle and just change it any color I'll just do this red you can either drag it onto the ball or just onto the spear which is basically the hand that's it guys i hope you enjoyed goodbye